in place of Eifert. Second and seven, Dalton from the gun. Under pressure, football comes loose. Who's got it? And now they say Cleveland football. Recovered by Emmanuel Agba. The left defensive end working on Jake Fisher. He turns the corner and what awareness to reach out there with that left hand, get it on the football and get it out. I mean, that is a great play by the second year player. And that's what the Cleveland Brown defense needs, making a great play. Second and five, one play called, and Crowell is blowing up in the backfield. Excellent play by Nick Vigil, who's had an excellent start to the season. The hook by that uh, three and out from Sean Kaiser and the Browns. So Dalton goes to the air, weighs on first and ten, and he completes right up to seam to his star wide receiver, A.J. Green. Opportunities when you have them. So Britton Cole put on the punt again. This is Adam Jones, who will play it from just inside his own 25. Jones running into some daylight. Sprung free by a couple of blockers. Jones inside Cleveland territory. Finally run out of bounds inside the 40-yard line. A great feel for this. It looked like the Browns had pretty good distribution, but right there, James Burgess, the outside linebacker, has to keep contained. You saw three or four uh, Cleveland Brown defenders to the inside. Once Pac-Man Jones gets to the outside, there's nobody. Football comes loose again. Who's got it this time? And it appears as though Cincinnati recovers the football. Incredible. Russell Bodine, their center, here out of the timeout. Joe Mixon, the lone setback, another low snap. Dalton had to go down low for it. He'll throw across his body here, and that pass is caught. That's the tight end, Tyler Croft. Boy, what a play by Dalton to get it to him. Dalton, fade pass, end zone, it's caught. A.J. Green for the touchdown. A brilliant pass by Dalton. He's really got the bulk of the playing time and has played well. Second and six, Kaiser, look out. Never saw Vigil coming. Hitters having that kind of access to your quarterback. Kaiser on third and long, fires a bullet, it's caught. Kenny Britt breaking tackles. What a pass by the rookie, Kaiser. A beautiful first down. Britt had a touchdown last week on a three. Catches Crowell breaking free. Getting downhill inside the 20, a pickup of 14. Five. Kaiser again from the shotgun on third and nine. Throws near side of the field. That pass deflected and intercepted. It's Clayton Fedulum. Unbelievable. And disaster for Cleveland. <sighs> Dalton under pressure and he is set. Second time they've gotten to him. Caleb Brantley, the rookie sixth round pick out of Florida. Eighth play of the drive. Dalton up the same has the tight end. It's Croft. First down Cincinnati. Much like Bosa was when he joined the Chargers last year. 13th play of the drive. Dalton to the end zone for the touchdown. It's Tyler Croft. And Dalton making it look easy. Wondered maybe if they just take a knee starting inside their own 20. They're feeling confident offensively. Underneath pass, this is Bernard. Plenty of daylight. Bernard still going. And he will score. <laughs> 61 yards on a catch and run from Dalton. Greg William blitzing in a two-minute situation. And look at all the Cincinnati Bengal offensive linemen down the field. There's nobody in second support to get to Giovanni Bernard. I mean, that is about as good a play call as you could possibly dial up, taking advantage to the blitz off of the right side. But there was a good play. Well, you said it. What a play by LaFell playing defense on that play as they avoid the turnover. This is Jeremy Hill breaking away. Inside the Cleveland 40, able to get downhill, finally tackled by Jamar Taylor down the field. 
Looks like a broken play here. Penalty flag thrown. Dalton looked like he was going to hand off. Now a run for the football. Dalton has some real estate in front of him. He won that preseason competition with Jake Elliott, a young man whom they took in the fifth round. Elliott, of course, hit that 61-yarder storm after huge storm. We hope that uh, they can pick up the pieces down in Puerto Rico as quickly as possible. We see Jabril Pepper is going to play it a couple of yards deep in his own end zone, breaking a couple of tackles. Springs himself free up the sideline and run out of bounds just shy of the 30. Defense that has struggled. They appear to have turned the corner. Dalton play action, throwing towards the end zone. It is caught. That's the tight end crawl for the touchdown. 16 yards from Dalton. See Johnson, the long setback. Hogan again to the air. Far side of the field, and it is caught. That's Ricardo Lewis. All of them extremely unique. I thought we saw some good things from him today. Still holds the ball a little bit too long. Mm. Boy, how did Hogan stay up initially? <laughs> First down pass from Hogan. Perfectly placed. Ricardo Lewis hit in stride. A pickup of 31. Who on that play didn't quite see the interference. Half the distance of the goal. And a run play, it's Duke Johnson in for the Cleveland touchdown. Cincinnati's going to take on a Buffalo team that uh, has given Atlanta all they can handle today. Buffalo's still winning that game. 23-17, late stages of the fourth quarter. And so that game will be played in Cincinnati next week, and Cleveland will stay home to take on the Jets. And week five, Hugh Jackson, Marvin Lewis, so much respect between them.